Today's goal is to skate on this beautiful mountain lake on Vancouver Island. We will mostly follow the saddle trail. It's roughly 3 kilometers one way and 600 meters of total gain. Brought ropes in case we need them to get down to the lake. Mount Aerosmith gets a lot of precipitation in the winter, so Jewel Lake usually gets snow covered very quickly after freezing, making it impossible to skate on. We had a couple cold snaps just before this weekend with a clear weather window for about five days before Lorraine and I went skating. I checked live satellite photos every day on Sentinel Hub Playground to make sure the ice is black and not covered in snow. You can get a rough idea of the snow levels on satellite photos, but there's also a weather station close by at a similar elevation and it was around an average of minus 7 or 19 degrees Fahrenheit for the last five days. This is enough time to have at least four inches of ice, assuming the water is already close to zero. You actually only need about two inches of ice to be able to skate. How neat is that? Oh my god. <laughs> Don't worry mom, she's sick. Ice freezes clear black like this because it is frozen slowly from the top. As it freezes, it pushes the impurities such as air bubbles down into the water below. Worth climbing this for the lake? Yes. <laughs> Definitely. Ooh. What a sweet spot. <laughs> Life with Mike! <laughs> climbing those ice falls behind the lake next time I get out here. So please subscribe to Nature Man Mike if you want to check that out.